<laughs> Hi, my name is Coach DeCurin and I'm Whacked Out Sports elective teacher. It's nice to meet you all and I'm going to run through with you Whacked Out Sports uh, syllabus and um, it's a pleasure to meet you all and if you have any questions along the way feel free to ask um, via email um, uh, anytime during the school year. Okay, so I'm going to share my screen with you to preview um, the syllabus. And we are going to walk through, um, the course description is to introduce students a wide variety of unconventional sports. And um, the reason for this is that we're, um, it allows us to all have fun while we're playing rather than just um, the only thing that we care about is winning um, because everyone will be entry level in all these activities for the most part. So it's not like I've played basketball my whole life and I'm gonna be a standout much better than everyone. And that isn't as much fun for everyone. In this case, it's everyone's having fun because we're all at the similar entry level and um, it's just sports that you don't play often. Um, but um, we're introducing sports and games in, in a non-traditional fashion that is just fun and enjoyable. So um, here's a list, pickleball, spike ball, cricket, croquet, bocce, um, four-way volleyball, badminton, tennis, baseball, CrossFit if we have to be indoors due to weather, um, and pillow polo, highlight, all really fun, cool games. Um, and so for me, it's a, it's a really fun elective um, that uh, gets these students kind of active um, as well at the same time. And um, student responsibilities are to um, follow the honor code of respect, first and foremost. Um, and then the, um, we've, we've talked to them about what their expectations are. They need their PE uniform, need a footwear, water bottle, um, because we're all keeping everything from nothing is being shared with cups and all that kind of stuff. You need your own water bottle, you need your own mask, all that kind of stuff. We're locking down and, and washing everything that we can that we hold and touch and lock rooms are only two at a time to make sure that we're um, following all the precautions needed um, by the CDC. Um, and um, keeping us all real safe. Um, so uh, grading um, criteria, um, each class students will um, receive three responsibility points based off of dressing out on time and respect, and then also three skill points, participation, inclusion, and performance growth. So um, for me, part, uh, the three um, skill points, the inclusion is important that you're being respectful to everybody and including everybody, and also you're participating, you're giving your effort. Um, and this, uh, the first aspect with responsibility points, we're dressing out, we're on time and we're respectful. And it's very easy to do all, all three of these from a responsibility standpoint. And it's very easy to do all three from the skill standpoint as well. So this should be a class of which um, the grade is there for the students um, as long as they abide by, um, by everything that we need to do.